Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make Windows 8 look completely like Windows 7. And a lot of videos are showing how to just make the start menu look like Windows 7. But I'll be showing you how to make the animations like this in the corner look like Windows 7. And the way the this PC looks like. Computer. Okay. So, first. I will put the links in the description. But you need to come to this website. You will then download this right here. Download 8.1 update. So, you will wait on that to download. After you click on this, it will download. After you press skip add, it will download. Okay? After that, you will have this. This is what the file looks like. Okay. So, if your system is not patched, please do so. And I'm sure it's not patched. So, Go back to the website, click patch your system if you have not done so. Click, scroll down and click website. Scroll down, scroll down again, click Windows 8, because I'm assuming that you have Windows 8, because this is what this video is about. And then open this up, and it's just simply just double click and install. Mine, I already have it, so it says uninstall, but you should just click install. It will be really simple. Okay. So after that, we go back here to this file, this first file that you downloaded, okay? Go to required, double click on required. Then double click on error glass settings. This will edit your registry. So you just click yes, it'll do it for you. You don't have to type in anything, just like that, okay? Both of them, not this, but these two right here. Okay, go back, go to themes. Okay, here are all the themes that you'll have. Okay, you need to put them in your directory. Directory. So just click install files here. It will take you to the directory that you need to install them in. Okay, so go back here. I press Control A. I'll click these and then Control C. Come back here. Control V for paste or right click and paste. Um, I don't know what's going on right now. Okay, paste. Anyways, after that, if you go ahead and try to change your theme, it's going to look funny right now, so don't worry about that right now. Um, after that, you need to download Aeroglass, so, which is this right here. So, this is the trial version. Um, if you want to deal with watermarks in constant notifications, go ahead and download it. If you know how to torrent things, then you should do that. So what I would do is go to Kickass Torrents, type in Aeroglass, and then Seed. And it's this one, Aeroglass, Windows 8.1, this one right here. That has the picture. Okay. After that, You'll have it in your torrent application, whatever you use to download torrents. Click on 1.2.5 and install it from there. Okay, I already have it, so I'm not going to do it, but you go through that. Okay, after that, um, I already did the registry edit files for you, or showed you how to do it, and... I did the themes for you. So, and now let's go to this right here. Old New Explorer. Scroll down right here, download right here. Okay. Open that up. Now, when you install this, make sure this is th these are the only things that you need to have checked off. Everything else, leave it. This is very important. So just leave this like this. These right here. Not this, not this, not this. Okay, just these. Press install, close. Good to go. Okay. Now. They recommend start is back. But I'm pretty sure you have to pay for that. So I recommend Classic Shell. 
in order to have a start menu that you know that looks like Windows 7 download now after that I'm gonna see if I can okay so once you install it'll have this so it'll look like this you know always stay like this so after that go to settings your skin change it to Windows arrow and then it's not it's probably gonna look like that at first or the Windows 8 squares the windows so go to custom pick image well again you're, you're gonna need to download that so go to classic shell Windows 7 start orb okay it should be the first link scroll down start button zip so what that will look like is this once you open it um, you'll have these files right here the last one is the best one Windows start button small because it fits the best okay after that after you've done all those things go to personalize and then go to arrow round clear so everything should look just like Windows 7 the animations everything even the start mint or the this PC looks like Windows 7 there's no like Windows, there's no windows right here or ribbons. Um, it just looks like how it used to. Not 100%, but for the most part, yes. Yep, and you're still going to have this. Um, you still need that. But everything else looks like it should. The way the animations are, the way it exits out, the way the X looks everything should be good to go okay leave any questions in the description and thank you for watching